Hokey dokey. Second example for this problem, I'll work it out much faster. If you'd like to see more of a breakdown, please visit the first example. In the first example, we kind of narrowed down the SIR model, the regular, you know, typical SIR model you will see, to just I prime here. And really it's a modified I prime as to what we would normally see. And it's from I prime that we get this nice equation in, uh, that allows us to calculate A. And we also have our B equation, which let's go ahead and calculate that first. So B is 1 divided by the days it takes to recover. So uh, starting with B, 1 divided by, looks like it says 11 days for a person to recover, yada, yada. So 1 divided by 11 should be B. 1 divided by 11 is equal to 0 0.0909. 0 0.0909 or 0 0.091. Uh, it looks like they use 0 0.0909. So we eliminate option C and D automatically. And then now we just have to calculate A. So using our little equation here, we'll go ahead and jump right into it to say that A is equal to I prime. I prime in this case is the rate of change of the infected over one day. And they told us that 35 became newly infected that day. So that will always sort of correspond to our I prime value, which is 35. All right, I have some te technical difficulties here. All right, let's keep going. I prime plus B, which we just calculated was 0 0.0909. In the denominator, we have the infected times the susceptible. So the infected on day seven is 300. And then we will always find the susceptible by taking the initial population and subtracting the amount that were infected. So we will have 155,300 minus 300. So it oftentimes just leaves us with the nice, clean hundreds, thousands number. So uh, we have our setup for A. Let's just calculate it. We have 35 plus 0 0.0909. And we're dividing by, I think it was 300 times 155,000. And we get about 7.54 times 10 to the negative 7. And looking through our answers, definitely the closest one is option A with 7.53 times 10 to the negative 7. So we break out the eraser to see that A is in fact our answer. So if you have any questions, please let me know. If you want to see another example and you haven't seen the first one already, feel free to check that out. And yeah, all right.